Oh, today I'm going to post the most important video of my life, okay? Today is the 30th of August, but I'm posting this on the 31st, okay? Today, I am going to start recording and documenting my life one minute a day, every single day, until I'm gone. Every single day, okay? And I mean it. Look at me, I mean it. And you can be my accountable buddy. So if I don't do it on one day, if you can point it out, I'll give you $100. That could be me dancing, that could be me talking about my thoughts of the day, that could be me washing the dishes, that could be me waking up, anything, anything for one minute a day. I'm gonna give you three reasons why I'm doing it and maybe it will inspire you to do it as well, okay? You don't have to, I'm just saying, I'm just saying, this is what I truly believe and I'm all about say as you do or do as you say. Hear me out. Point number one, okay, why you should do this, all right? Think about, I want you to think about right now, what's the most important, important things, what's the most valuable things in your life? What's the most important valuable thing? Just, just think of something, okay? Okay, that could probably be time, okay? That could probably be love and relationships. Okay, they definitely not, it's not money because there's more valuable things in life, right? That could be experiences, right? So all of those things are covered if you start filming yourself, documentary. Listen to me, hear, hear me out. So, back in the days, so how did they document their life? They take photos, right? So you take photos and what they say oftentimes, like even yourself, myself, right? I'm 26 this year. What I wish I did more was take more photos, right? Because the photos capture a moment in life and time that's you in that moment, right? And it's so nostalgic to look back at that moment, right? So that was back in the days, but now we can take videos, right? If you're watching this, if you're watching this on the cell phone or Anyway, if you're watching this, you are lucky enough to be able to take a video for yourself. And just think about yourself in 80 years old. 80 years old, that could be Anna, that could be Jezebel, that could be Dean, whatever your name is, okay? Just think about it. What would you thank your present self for right now, right? Think about it. I know for me, I would thank Jeff, for 26 Jeff, to film more videos of himself so I can look back at, oh shit, that's what I was doing, that's what I was thinking at that time. That's the most valuable thing I see for my future self, right? And think about for your kids, for your grand grandkids, whatever, right? For them to have something to look at. Wow, that was my grandpa when he was young, boom. What? Right, it's so valuable. Like for me, that's, that's the most important thing, right? That's one, why I'm telling you to upload online, okay? That comes to number two, number two, okay? Number two is because once I started running this dance studio, okay, I run a dance studio in Sydney, Australia, I realized this, uh, everything costs, right? Like, I didn't really think about this before. Like, I realized things cost, but like, I didn't think about storage, right? If you think about your phone, if you think, if you think about your computer, there's storage in it. It could be 128 gigs, it could be 260, 556 gigs, whatever it is, right? There's a price on the storage. Once you start filming a lot of videos, it's gonna take a lot of, a lot of space, right? And you gotta clean your space. We have to buy, external hard drives, a little thing like this, right? This is like one terabyte. But this thing here costs around, I think I got it for 300 or a bit more for one thing like this, okay? And this is to store your memories. Just think about it, it's to store your memories. And then, that's hard drive, that's offline. So I started this online dance tutorial thing, right? So when I went online, I realized, wow, it costs money to store online as well. Like, for example, when you're running a website, it costs you more to store more videos. Hmm. So what I'm saying is YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, all of that, it doesn't cost you a cent to upload. So for me, to, I see it as a free storage place. If you have all these videos, if you if record one every day for 20 years, you're gonna have so much videos, you're gonna have nowhere to place it, right? So that's why I think upload your videos on different platforms as well. So just in case one goes down, you have another that you know is there to look at, right? So that's number two. Number three, and this is the reason why I think posting it is the final part. If you're already doing part one and two, if you already got inspired to record yourself, that could be once a week, that could be once a month to do it and upload it, great, good on you. That's amazing already. I'm all about do as you say or say as you do. And I always preach about, preach, um, I always talk about, right, talk about no judgments, insecurities out of the door and just do what feels right. It comes a long way. No one really knows how you feel. No one really knows what I went through. Like no one knows, same as you. You know what you went through, you know how you feel. And for me, I know I went through such a dark time that 
insecurities and judgment doesn't really matter anymore. Like I, I'm still fearful, that, don't get me wrong. I'm still fearful of um, like posting a video online because I'm like, oh shit, something might happen. But I'm, I, I'm gonna do it anyways. It's a coherence of who I am as a person. Like I don't really care about what people think, right? If I talk about that, I gotta be that. Does that make sense? So yeah, that's why I'm posting it as well. And if I care about views, I wouldn't be posting these videos, right? If you look at it, this is my past views for posting videos like this. If I'm care about views, I wouldn't be documenting this every day. Just imagine, 80 years out, 70 years out, you're gonna be so grateful that you've done these videos because you've done these things, what I mentioned before, okay? That's it for all three of the reasons why I think you should do it, okay? You don't have to post them, you can just store online, you can do one like every week, every month, whatever it is, but I think, honestly, my biggest take on life right now, in this situation where we live in, okay, there's always pros and cons of the era we live in, but right now, we're going to a digital realm, okay, so it's important to store yourself into that. And one more thing, if you're not going yet, okay, this is a bit more deeper level, because I'm a, like a deep level kind of guy. If you think about it, if you were gone today, like if I'm gone tomorrow, from this earth, from this planet, what can people look back is my videos that I've uploaded in the past. Right, so that's like a legacy for itself. Cause Jeff physically is gone, but Jeff digitally is still there. How weird is that? Like, you know what I mean? And I think that's something crazy to think about. I wanna leave behind some good things, things that helped me in the past. So when people look at it, or if they you know, get a chance to look at it, they can inspire them to do something better, right? So it's important to leave behind things that helped you and maybe will help others as well. So that's what I'm thinking, okay? Maybe I'm a bit crazy, but one video a day, starting today. Start, I'm starting tomorrow. Today's today's video, okay? Yeah. Let's do it.